Hello, I'm Atreus and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Mexico. We're about to invade the United Kingdom. I believe we have to launch yellow first. And then the rest of you ready to go? No complaints? Other than division still preparing. Uh, whatever that means. They're always still preparing. Right. Yellow. I think it's yellow, red, orange, blue, and purple. Uh, we'll grab anti tank three. Still got to look out for the fact that there is a lot of firepower coming down on this side. To the point where I think we'll actually have to just quickly adjust the number of fighters to give us some better cover. Oh, God. We're losing it. Okay, yellow's on the way. Three. Two. One. Go red. Three. Two. One. Go orange. Three. Two. One. Go blue. Go light blue. We're on. The invasion begins now. Maybe we should get to New King. Oh, but we don't have air coverage in most of these places. We have nine nukes. Let's do it. We can get control down here. One. Two. Ooh. Alright, keep dropping those nukes. And, oh, also we'll drop a nuke here. And here. We're on. Why can't I drop nuke here? Oh, they've they've put up the response. They're afraid of us. Okay, we're gonna have to start going to a lower speed to manage this. Uh, we need to grab a port. We're gonna go south. We're gonna get Rosyth. How are we doing over here? That's not a port. This is a port. We're gonna grab that port. Most important one is we managed to get a landing near London by the looks of it. Get to London. If we can grab London, we're basically in. Still can't nuke. Okay, we've got a port over there. Um, get Newcastle. Half of you. Get to Rosseth. So far, this has worked. London is almost ours. I'm not going to commit my reinforcements yet. Come on, London. How long will it take you to get there? 
Ah, uh, like two more dice. Okay. You're cut off from the rest of your group. Get one of the heavy army units to head for Rosith. Get the other one to head to Edinburgh, maybe. Oh, let's also add, like, a lot of infantry to this push. Yeah, that feels more like it. Let's also grab one of these motorized units and just get them to, like, pop down to Dover. Oh. Oh, hello. Have they just, like, suddenly abandoned, like, Plymouth? Oh, that's it. If they've abandoned, like, that much of the country, we just need to grab it. Well, London's ours. Dover's now the capital, but we should be sending someone down to Dover. Dover's going to be ours soon. United Kingdom has capitulated. Oh, completely. They've got like a tiny island here. But other than that, it's all over, baby. Oh, that's beautiful. That is that is glorious. The United Kingdom is out of the war. All right, let's look at the uh, current wars. Mexican-American War. Which, funnily enough, Me uh, America isn't in because America actually fell out of the war um, a long time ago. But whatever. Still not sure how that happened. France. Greece. Cuba, Netherlands. A lot of these are mini-nations, so we don't have to worry about them. How do we determine who we need to win? Who do we need to beat to win the war? We've lost 4.3 million people. France lost a million. United Kingdom's lost a million. A lot of 200,000s in there. Half a million from the Netherlands. 400 from Belgium. Half a million from Germany. A million from Japan. Almost 400 from Peru. Okay. It tells us somewhere who we have to beat to end the war. But I can't for the life of me remember who it is or where I find it. Okay. I guess we continue on. I know I need France, probably the German Republic, probably Spain, Italy, Yugoslavia, so we're going to hit the mainland and do it from there. Okay, how are we going to do this? How are we going to hit the mainland? How are we going to take them all out? Also, let's have a quick look. Yeah, there's still 13,000 goddamn fighters over there. That means I can't nuke. That's a shame. It really did help nuke in the United Kingdom. Uh, okay, we're going to do this by... I think a, a full invasion of just France to begin with. We'll expand from there later on. Do this the old-fashioned way. Remember, I don't have the benefit of nukes on this one. do that. Same time, it's very tempting to go up here and hit these. If I were to do that, that's better. 
It's a very large frontage cover, but the idea is just to, like, annoy them. And then... Reinforcements. Fallback line. Oh, hello. The British Navy got pushed out. Holy crap, that is, uh... I was wondering. I thought they were dead because they weren't in the war, but actually... Actually, they've got a full-on Navy. Well, I did not expect that. Now, I wonder if we can get enough naval bombs over here to actually help out. Let's get you up to 2,000, which is your limit. Oh, okay. 1,000 and then 2,000. We're going to make sure the English Channel is just flooded with torpedo bombers. Um. Whoa! Look how many fighters we lost! Dear God, I think we just have to abandon that unit. Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. We've lost the Iberian region there. That's fine. We didn't ever need these close air support units. We'll actually leave them where they are. I'd like to fly you down to... So many damaged airfields. I'm trying to find out where we can go. Go to Gloucestershire. We'll reduce your number. And then go to the channel. Close that support. You're fine. Yeah, you need to be axed. Yeah. Death is going to be brutal. We don't have the actual firepower to keep up with that. They keep threatening my Florida coast. I don't see it happening, personally. Who does wins? Right, how are we doing for the recruitment? Yeah, you need the artillery. Right, we're there. We're fighting for it. Hopefully... Those naval bombers we put in will do some, you know, good. Also, we're going to go large. Go large or go home. Uh, where? <laughs> where are my navy set meant to be up here? The one the one time I desperately need the navies. Oh, you're actually fighting. Okay, um. Yeah, we're going to... Bring, bring you down to like the English Channel and um, yeah, you, you should definitely get into a fight down there. And as for the Mediterranean, I'm going to abandon that. Let's focus on taking out the ones in the Channel. Come on, where are my 2,000 naval bombers that should be helping out? Oh, not with that kind of enemy firepower. Mission will not be executed. Oh, because it's priority. Oh, here we go. More of our ships coming into the fray. We need control of this passageway. And if they have a navy... That threatens it. Oh, uh, yeah, you should probably be on that side. I think you turned away because you uh, lost your invasion.
Yeah, with that many battleships, there's no way you can really take them down. Oh, we shot down one of their, like, aces. That's fine by me. It's a bloody battle, but they're winning so far by quite a long margin. Look at the number of destroyers down. We just need our air power to, like, pick up the pace. Oh, God, look at the number of fighters and stuff they have. 11,000. We're somewhat outnumbered. Ooh. From Kamikaze strikes and ships in the area. You know what? Don't want to do it with my, with my fighter planes. My normal ones, at least. Not the jet fighters by, by any stretch of the imagination. But you know what we could do? Mm, fighter ones are pretty terrible. There's only three of the fighter ones. You know what we'll do? We'll do fighter twos. Kamikaze strike. I believe in you. <laughs> oh, pardon me. So many aircraft. And they're trashing us. Damn Royal Navy. I thought you'd be obliterated, but I did think that that was maybe a bit of wishful thinking. Oh god, they took down our uh, ace. New ace. In fact, let's get some aces for our naval bomber units. do it. Come on. Bring him down. Oh god, is that it? Is that the fight over? Yeah, incredibly bloody. Could have been a bit worse, but still pretty terrible. Mm, fine. They're trying to get away. I'm really hoping that we get a chance to shoot them down. shoot anything down with our uh, ridiculous number of torpedo bombs, which I'm somewhat disappointed about. Oh, hello. Make sure we're covering this area as well. There goes a carrier. I'm going to have to start making my navy again, that's right. Once we hit mainland Europe, it won't be an issue. We actually have no one covering up here. Whoopsie! Looks like they put a lot of their uh, fighters and bombers out. I'm no longer seeing like quintuple digit numbers. That's five, isn't it? But we're still seeing, you know, four digit numbers. Quintuple, that's the one. Yeah, and they're trying to take a prop pounding against us. And they've got subs in the channel as well. I do not like the idea of that. Do I have some spare bombers? Not bombers, destroyers. Probably. You are not really a big enough group, but you know what? You'll do. Where else are you? Just 
guard the channel and the Bay of Biscay and the North Sea. But the point being the channel. I like we found some of their uh, submarines. Yes. They're going down fairly quick. We're going to need more destroyers though if we're going to pull this one off. This is going to be one crazy fight over here. Why are you not at the invasion site? I'll manually send you down there. I'm not sure why you aren't down at your, uh... Oh god, what did I just do? Ah, god damn it! I just sent you to a different unit, didn't I? No, oh, it's okay. We didn't lose much time, and to be honest, we need a little bit more time for prep. Right, research. Um, operational destruction air support. There we go. Kill a load of their subs. It's brutal in that channel. And I don't think we're going to get the chance to uh, bomb Paris anytime soon, so it's going to be down to the land forces. Right. Well, if you're not going to go there, like, by yourself, I'm going to tell you to do it manually. Why are you there? You're meant to be up here, ready to invade. No idea. Ah, uh, we lost uh, a heavy cruiser. Killed seven more subs. And it looks like we've got control of the air. At severe cost. Oh, look at all those um, naval fighters that are now standing by there. Those are from the destroyed uh, carriers. That's pretty brutal. Right, jet fighters are pretty injured. They're okay, they're on kamikaze mode. Yeah, we just need more jet fighters. Okay. Well, in a couple of months we'll be able to do the invasion of uh, Europe. It's been a bit brutal so far. But I have some faith that we should be able to do this once we get onto land. The UK went down uh, quickly enough. Just a question of can we get the rest of Europe to follow suit? Until then, though, I've been Netrelisting. If you've liked, like, and not subscribe, please consider subscribing. Also, consider hitting the little bell icon next to subscribe. That way, you actually get notified about videos. And until the invasion of the rest of Europe, stay shiny.